Hey guys, I'm uh, just doing a quick update on my Henry Lever Action 22. Um, well, I just got done shooting and cleaning it. Today I shot 22 shorts by CCI. They were pretty good. I thought they'd be a little more quiet, but they're still there's a big difference between long rifle and short in terms of noise wise so I'm pretty happy with that I'll probably be buying more shorts just because it holds more in the in the tube and just because they're a lot quieter don't have to worry about neighbors and all that but update on my Henry It's all clean and shiny. Um, so far, I've shot three round or three different types of rounds, which is CCI, Winchester Wildcats, and Remington Golden Bullet. Um, I've shot about 30 Winchester, because that's all I had left in the box. 42. No, not 42. Um, 35, approximately, and then 40, 42 shorts. Because I can put 21 rounds of 22 shorts in in the tube. Um, no, no failure to fires. No failures to eject. Um, the 22s had some of them had a problem ejecting completely. What I mean by that, when I tried to eject some of them, they'd like pop out of the chamber, but it would stay, it wouldn't come out completely. I don't know, it's hard to explain, but I just tipped the gun on its side and it fell right out. It's not a big problem because it, these would not be for self defense or anything. I was just trying them out. I've never shot 22 short before ever. Go oh, by the way, these are 29 grain at 710 feet per second with a lead round nose. They were about eight bucks for 100 rounds, but so far no malfunctions. Um, they shot well. I haven't done accuracy test yet. But a but a hundred hundred uh, plastic plates to to shoot at. Those are cheap targets and work pretty well. I'd recommend those if you haven't tried them yet. But I'm surprised at how well it's performing, and it's my new favorite gun for sure, without a doubt. Um, and that's pretty much it. I just wanted to update since I've been shooting the past three weekends since I got it and I'm completely happy with it. It was definitely worth the 270 bucks that I paid. Um, next time I go to the store I'll probably pick up 22 longs try those out and then I'll have to update again but other than that I'm pretty happy even these compared to my 1022 they shot pretty well 1022 hates these it was like three malfunctions per 10 round magazine so those were awful these were these were pretty good in my 1022 so these are one of my favorite rounds now. I'd recommend them. But really, other than that, that's about it. Uh, thanks for watching, and have a good day.